It's a beautiful uh, Friday afternoon here in the West Fjords uh, region. To be specific, it's in uh, Patrick's Fjord Dior, and this is the hotel that I just uh, checked in. And uh, and now is uh, five o'clock uh, p.m. and uh, it's a it's a wonderful uh, it's wonderful weather today. You know, it's sunny, and that is unusual in uh, here in uh, in Iceland. And I. Uh, I'm gonna do my uh, my walk and talk here in this uh, small uh, small charming town called uh, Patrick's Fjord Door, and it is in the uh, it's in very very remote uh, region here in uh, in this beautiful land, beautiful country called Iceland, and uh, you know uh, I'm gonna stay here. Uh, I'm gonna stay in this uh, small town for a. Uh, for a couple nights, you know, uh, just relax and uh, and today uh, I uh, I spent uh, the better part of uh, two hours, uh, you know, driving on a driving a gravel road all the way from the capital of uh, West Fjords, and that is uh, SF Fjord Dior, and uh, and I visited uh, many many. Uh, Many many stops, uh, many many sites, I should say, along the way, uh, and uh, one of them is the uh, uh, Dendiani uh, uh, waterfall, and that was really really a uh, beautiful uh, visit, you know, uh, and you can uh, you can uh, watch my video for that. It's very very beautiful, uh, beautiful waterfall, and then uh, on my way to this hotel. Uh, I visited the uh, the shipwreck uh, Gardar uh, BA64 uh, shipwreck, and I uh, and I and I posted a video for that too. And now uh, I'm uh, I'm walking along this uh, beautiful shore here. You see, with open view of the uh, fjord here in this uh, region, and it's really really beautiful, uh, small uh, small town. And I say, why not just uh, do uh, what I do best, which is just uh, just walk uh, walk along the you know walk in this town and just uh, walk and talk and uh, talk about random things you know uh, about life and all that kind of stuff. You see, uh, not a lot of people live here. Uh, you know, I did a similar uh, walk and talk video in uh, in the capital of uh, the West Fjord. Uh, West Fjords region and uh, and that is uh, also beautiful uh, beautiful town you look at these uh, you look at these uh, beautiful uh, homes here you know uh, really really beautiful I just want to give you a sense of what uh, life is like here in this uh, in this remote area and uh, just to let you know this region is not uh, is not along the uh, the ring road by any means this is very uh very very far from the uh from the typical ring road that most tourists uh take this is really uh way way uh, uh, uh you know uh, far and uh and if you visit this region will you will uh you will not regret it you know uh, it's so uh, so many uh so many uh beautiful uh you know of the beaten path uh, places uh, you know sometimes you go to a nice uh, nice site uh, you know you enjoy the whole uh, site to uh, yourself and here uh, here now I am walking and uh, I have a full day of activities tomorrow I booked myself uh, you know two couple nights here and a couple nights uh, just to uh, just to uh, relax and uh, recharge my energy, you know. You know, so it's, uh, it's really uh, it's really good when you travel slow. You know, uh, you do a you do a slow travel. You don't uh, you don't schedule too much uh, too much stuff. You know, uh, you know. I hate uh, I hate when I do that. You know. Uh, right now, I am uh, I've been uh, I've been in Iceland for the better part of. Uh, more than two weeks now you know and I took my time you know uh, 
you know unlike other people that you know they just uh, try to drive the ring road and uh, just they're, they're, they're always in rush you know they try to do everything in uh, in 10 days or eight days uh, I know I, 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 if, if you want if you want to visit this beautiful uh, beautiful country you know uh, and you want to do what I uh, what I do here in Iceland you know allow uh, give yourself at least three weeks you know you know because you get tired by the time you uh, the second week you get tired that's when you want to uh, relax and uh, stay at least to a couple nights in one uh, in one location you know just to uh, just to take a break and this is what I am doing right now right now it's five o'clock p.m. and uh, and you know uh, if uh, five o'clock p.m. and the daylights uh, are very long here daylights hours are very long in the summertime today is August uh, August uh, today's what uh, August 6th if I'm not mistaken yeah August 6th and uh, and I still have uh, you know the sunset here is uh, is around 11 it's about 11 uh, or 11 p.m. 11 11 30 p.m. but it doesn't really get dark in the summertime so you might so you might have a you know if you have a sleeping problem you might uh, this might be an issue for you you know but most hotels uh, most hotels that I stayed at you know uh, they have really really good uh, curtain you know where you uh, where you uh, close the curtain windows curtain and uh, and uh, it's very dark the room the room becomes uh, 100% uh, you see darkness everywhere in the room so they did a good job you know I, I've, uh, every time I check in a hotel in uh, Iceland I, uh, I make a video you know just to uh, just for memory you know so I can see my uh, I can see my own uh, videos in the future you know and also uh, they might be helpful to other people who want to do uh, who want to do a uh, similar uh, itinerary you see this is another hotel now along the way see this is the main uh, the main road is there is only one main road and the lady at uh, the reception the hotel reception told me if I can go uh, if I can go to the, the, the street behind this uh, hotel there will be a uh, nice uh, views and uh, nice uh, nice uh, town small town I'm gonna do that I'm just gonna walk here and uh, and I see a couple of people uh, walking uh, on the same path uh, coming toward me and there is a beautiful church up ahead and you know uh, you know not a lot of people are doing what I do now you know uh, you know most tourists they uh, they just uh, hello. hello they just go to the big uh, to the big attraction sites and uh, you know they never give themselves uh, healing time you know time just to relax and uh, you see uh, I checked in this hotel around 4 o'clock uh, p.m. and that's too early to end my day and I said you know what uh, I don't know I don't want to do any big uh, big activity you know for today I, and let's go and uh, let's go and do a walk a walk and talk video and explore this uh, beautiful town I really want to see what, how the uh, how the local life here is uh, is like you know it's really interesting to uh, to go all the way to the uh, you know to uh, to a very re remote area in uh, in, a, in Iceland and uh, you really want to see how the uh, how the local life is here you know how the uh, do they have schools do they have uh, grocery stores how do they live you know because it's a very remote area you know it took me about uh, it took me the better part of three hours just driving here and uh, and the road uh, was it's a gra was it's a gravel road here it's very tough to drive here and I keep uh, thinking you know uh, to myself how the hell they get uh, all these supplies you know for uh, you know their supplies food and uh, and all that kind of stuff you know and I I think they get them by boat you see uh, maybe there is a port here somewhere here you know and uh, and isn't it something uh, you know it's very nice when you uh, 
when you just walk uh, like this and just film just film the whole thing you know just film the whole thing and let uh, let uh, share it with the world you see this there is a nice uh nice beautiful uh nice beautiful uh church just uh, just on the other side of the street and uh and i chose to uh to uh walk along this uh shore just to uh, enjoy the uh just to enjoy the ocean view the fjord view i should say and uh there is some kind of uh complex uh residential area up ahead and that's where i am trying to uh to to go to you know tomorrow uh, tomorrow i'm gonna start my day uh i'm gonna start my day early tomorrow around eight o'clock in the morning i'll uh, wake up and uh wake up in the morning they serve uh, breakfast in my uh, in the uh, in my hotel I, I, that i just checked in they serve uh, breakfast and uh, i'm gonna take uh, i'm gonna eat breakfast in the morning and then uh, i'm gonna be headed to uh, one of the most uh, beautiful places in the world you know and that place is very very unique it's unique because of its uh, location you know if, because of its geography is the uh, is the uh, west uh, if it's the westernmost uh, part of Europe you know so you where you can uh, just stand on the cliff and that cliff happens to be the the westernmost part of uh, of the uh, of Europe so isn't that something there is some kind of uh, construction uh, going on you know there is no shortage of constructions here uh, along the way i think they're building roads you know they have uh, they have shortage of uh, shortage of uh, paved uh, roads here uh, some uh, some sites uh, you know you need to uh, you need to be very careful when you drive uh, you know uh, the uh, most of the roads to are gravel roads and gravel when you drive gravel roads uh, rocks can uh, hit your uh, windshield you know and they can crack your uh, windshield so if you're uh, renting a car and uh, in iceland and you're planning to uh you're planning on uh driving the whole uh, island you know uh get yourself uh, a gravel road uh, gravel uh, insurance coverage you know from the rental company so that you have a peace of mind you know my uh, my windshield got cracked because of the uh, rocks hit uh, my windshield but i uh, but you know i am uh, fully protected you know i uh, i i got myself full uh, coverage and here i am walking toward the end of the uh, of this road and i see a small uh, small residential area and a very nice uh, very nice uh, house up ahead i just want to walk there and see what kind of houses they have uh, you know i would imagine this uh in this uh region in the winter in the winter time is uh it's gonna be uh horrible you know you know the west fjords west fjords region uh, let me turn around the camera show my face the uh the west fjords region is the coldest uh it's the coldest uh, uh, region in uh, in Iceland. It's very cold and windy, you know. And today, just uh, much to my uh, delight, uh, it's a little bit warm. But here, when it's warm, it's re it's not really warm, you know. You still need uh, you still need a light jacket, like what I'm wearing right now. You see, today is warm, you know. But the temperature never gets uh, you know higher than uh, 65 degrees, you know, since. Uh, you know uh, in the last uh in the last what uh two weeks uh temperature never uh, gone up to uh above 65 degrees you know it's always around you know 55 degrees right now as i'm speaking it's uh, 55 degrees Fahrenheit, and it's a little bit windy you know see when you see the temperature uh 55 degrees Fahrenheit, and uh, and don't think that it's uh it's it's uh it's warm you know because it's, it feels colder than uh, it feels colder because of, because of the wind, you know, the wind. Let me uh, let me show you uh, let me show you those small uh, small houses. 
over there you see isn't it something and uh, I really uh, I really encourage you to uh, to glance through my uh, channel uh, the Iceland uh, Iceland playlist and uh, see uh, see my adventure you know if you want to do a similar itinerary you know you can uh, you can just uh, you can just watch my uh, my Iceland uh, playlist you know and uh, and see what kind of sites I have uh, visited you know I almost visited every uh, every single site that you uh, that you you might imagine you know and uh, and the way I do my uh, the way I do my videos is uh, every site I go like for example I go to a specific waterfall I make a I make a separate video for it you know unlike other people they, they they do it the way they do it they said day one they went to this place they went to that place you know let's let's get let's let's this truck uh, pass and I will uh, I'll continue talking I'm gonna go this way now you know uh, the other youtubers the way they do it uh, they uh, you know they they do like they said day one day two day three day one is separate video and day two and and so on and uh, but for me I, I prefer to uh, to do a video for each site you know and my video tends to be very long and uh, and um, you know and the reason why I'm doing this uh, walk and talk is just to uh, just for memory you know just to just to put it somewhere on the internet just for my for myself and uh, and who knows maybe somebody in the future uh, you know you maybe YouTube uh, algorithm might uh, suggest this video to somebody but I don't really uh, expect a lot of uh, a lot of traffic in my uh, on my uh, channel I get really really uh, low views you know for some reason but that doesn't bother me you know uh, you know whether it uh, whether I get zero uh, zero view or uh, 1000 views or 10,000 views it doesn't it's not really annoying you know doing uh, you know doing YouTube is like a, a crap shoot you know you never know what you're gonna get when you upload a video you might get uh, zero view it might get uh, 15,000 views you know some of my view some of my YouTube uh, videos have uh, over 15,000 views or 10,000 views and some videos get like two views three views you know so I really don't know what I'm gonna get you know look uh, this is seems to be a, a pharmacy if I'm not mistaken you see it's in Icelandic and uh, I don't know I, I don't I don't understand Icelandic and uh, and I entered here uh, the uh, the street that uh, that the lady at the reception the hotel reception suggested uh, and now I can see uh, I can see the real charming town you can see what kind of uh, homes people live in uh, this area and if in you know in Iceland every single home in Iceland you see the way they uh, they design their windows you know like this one you see you see the window when they open it it's uh, you slide it up or you know you cannot slide it to the to the side it always uh, you can slide it up and the reason for that is because uh, of the volcanoes you know let me let me show you another another window so you get what I'm you get an idea of what I'm talking about you see you see like uh, you see like this uh, you see like this one you see you see how they uh, they design their windows you see that's how they open uh, their windows and that is because of the uh, volcanoes and there is some kind of uh, a museum here I'm not sure what that is let me uh, let me uh, let me show you you know uh, maybe uh, yeah it's in Icelandic everything is in Icelandic here you know uh, you're not gonna see uh, you're not gonna see tourists uh, here you know uh, you're not you're not gonna see uh, that's why it's not uh, the signs are not in English you know everything is in Icelandic because they don't expect uh, foreigners to come to this to this uh, town but uh, 
but I'm doing this trip you know uh, not just to go to the tourist uh, touristy area you know I like to uh, I like to explore uh, I like to explore go to local uh, towns where uh, where the local people live you know and I want to see what uh, what uh, what kind of life they have here you know uh, you know it's really really uh, amazing you look at the, you look at the map of the world you know you just look at the map of the world and I don't know what part of the, the world you live in but wherever whatever part of the world you live in just look at the map of the world and look at the location of Iceland you know and it's really really uh, in a in, an, uh, in a, a unique location where the two uh, tectonic plates uh, meet each other the uh, the American tectonic plate and uh, and the European tectonic plates meet, meet each other and I uh, I made so many videos about of the uh, sites where uh, where the two tectonic plates uh, meet each other you know you look at, at that location and you see you see uh, and I think to myself am I really am I really here you know in this uh, unique location and look at this uh, look at this you see it's a nice uh, nice a uh, nice home very nice home two st two stories home and then uh, and then you look at this beautiful uh, beautiful view you know uh, I really cannot just walk and uh, and don't say anything I just uh, this is my uh, this is my usual style you know I just uh, just walk and talk and and see uh, you know it's really uh, it's not, 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 a lot, not a lot of people are out and about and uh, and I have uh, half an hour uh, left to uh, to go eat dinner I, uh, when I checked in uh, the way it works for dinner is that you have to make a reservation uh, because of COVID they uh, they have to take your name and they give you a specific time where you have to eat and uh, so they told me do you want to eat at 6 30 p.m. 7 p.m. or uh, or 8 p.m. I said you know I'm so hungry let's let's eat at uh, 6 30 p.m. so I have to show up at 6 30 p.m. or or else I will uh, uh, miss that uh, miss that spot there is another uh, restaurant here just in case you want to uh, to eat small cafe maybe uh, maybe tomorrow you know I'm gonna eat here and I, I really uh, sometimes you know uh, the food at the hotel is very good and the plus price is not that uh, you don't pay a hefty price for it you know but uh, but if I stay a couple nights at a specific hotel, what I do, I eat the first night, I eat at the hotel, and then the second night I go to a local uh, local restaurant such as, such as this one. I just want to see what kind of food they have, you see? This is the, uh, this is the menu here, you know? And, uh, and there is a picnic, uh, picnic table here where you can just sit outside and enjoy this uh, beautiful uh, beautiful town they have nice uh, nice uh, nice setting here it's very very serene uh, serene setting in uh, and here is the uh, here is the restaurant so inside you can just sit inside it's not really uh, it's not a crowded uh, town it's a very small town you know just you can uh, you can uh, stay overnight here and uh, you know with the west uh, the west fjords uh, the west fjords region is very big by the way you, know, you cannot just uh, say uh, I'm gonna visit the west fjords for two nights no I, th I think you need at least five days four days just to uh, you know just to uh, just to relax and uh, because every 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 site is uh, far from each other you know when you jump from one site to another in the west fjords uh, probably you're gonna waste two hours three hours so what you need to do just uh, plan ahead and just uh, and just uh, probably you might need to stay in uh, two different uh, uh, two different hotels in uh, in the West Fjords and uh, 
you can watch my YouTube uh, yeah, your videos to see what uh, what hotels I stayed at uh, in the West Fjords region. If you want to copy my uh, itinerary, there is a church here, you see, and uh, I really love the uh, the Icelandic design of uh, church. You know, let's see, uh, let's see if I can uh, if I can uh, give you a, a good viewing uh, point from this. Uh, you see. And uh, it's closed now. Today's uh, today is Friday. Yeah, today is Friday. And then next week I'm gonna be uh, headed back to the to California. My home base is in California. So uh, and uh, and I have to take uh, I have to take a test. Uh, you know, before uh, 72 hours before my uh, my flight. So I'm gonna drive. Uh, in my last uh, two nights, uh, the last two nights, I'm gonna be staying in uh, Reykjavik, and I'm gonna visit the volcano uh, that is still uh, that is still active. It's still erupting. So, uh, and that volcano is close to Reykjavik uh, airport. And, uh, but on my way to Reykjavik, uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna be staying uh, for two nights in. Uh, in the west uh, peninsula on the western uh, western part of uh, of the uh, of iceland and uh, i really hope you enjoyed this uh this walk and talk and uh and if you have any question you know uh, if you have any question about uh about uh, iceland you know uh, just uh just put it on the uh in the comment section and uh and I, I don't really uh, expect uh, a lot of people finding this uh, this video so maybe uh, maybe I'm gonna get maybe five views ten views so I am uh, I'm really walking and talking to myself but I'm actually talking to a camera and then what I do is uh, you know I keep that video uploaded and see uh, it's really fun when you watch uh, your own video you know and it's really good memory too, you know. Really good memory. So you you see yourself uh, five years from now, you know. You say, "Oh wow, I walked in this uh, remote area when I was at this age." You know, you can show your uh, your uh, your relatives, your kids, your gra grandkids. You know, these these things last forever. You know. So if you uh, if I get zero view or uh, no traffic at all, it's not really a it's not really a problem for me because that's not my priority my priority is just to keep something for memory you know and here is another hotel hotel west this is the entrance to the uh to the hotel it looks very nice you see so far i think I, there, are, there are only two hotels uh in this uh in this small town and uh and the other one, the one that I am uh, staying at, is called Foss Foss Hotel West Fjords. And Foss Hotels is a, a big uh, hotel chain here in uh, in Iceland. You will see a lot of hotels start with name Foss Foss Hotel. And there is a look at those uh, homes here. You know, it's very nice. You know, I'm really glad that I made the. Uh, I made it to Iceland, you know, before uh, before they uh, before they add more uh, COVID restrictions. You know, with everything going on, you don't know what's gonna happen. They keep changing the rules, you know, by the day. So uh, I'm happy that I uh, I, uh, I visited all the uh, sites that I uh, that I, you know that I've been uh, dreaming dreaming in years. You know, you know, it's really. I feel like I, I accomplished uh, accomplished a lot, you know. And you know what I uh, what makes me feel good, you know. Uh, you know when I visit uh, when I visit a beautiful country like this, you know what makes me feel good is that uh, is that I had the opportunity to uh, to. Oh, you, you know the sun is facing me, so it's uh, you're not gonna see my face because of the uh, sun glare. So. Uh, it's really sunny today. You know what makes me uh, happy is that uh, I got the opportunity to film uh, to film my adventure, you know, in Iceland. So, uh, so uh, 
so that is the best thing I've done in uh, in this uh, on this trip what is going on here uh, there is some kind of uh, viewing platform here where you just can uh, read uh, read information and uh, you see everything in uh, in Icelandic you not in uh, not in, in English and I am sure this guy is uh, there is a history behind it so maybe he's a famous guy but everything is in Icelandic and anyway you can just uh, you can just uh, sit here and what 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 a beautiful uh, what a beautiful uh, place you know uh, I'm really really happy uh, I'm really happy now okay now the sun is uh, then now the sun is cooperating with me you can see my face you know I'm really uh, I'm really happy that I uh, documented my uh, my trip uh, to be quite honest with you uh, you know whoever uh, found my uh, you know if you discovered my YouTube video you know uh, you know if you're still watching you know uh, my only advice uh, you know uh, for you if you uh, if you travel just uh, do what I do you know just film just film your adventure you know uh, you don't have to be a perfect youtuber you know don't worry about traffic don't worry about viewers subscribers you know just just for yourself you know just film it film it and uh, it's a wonderful thing to be quite honest with you it's very really, really really wonderful thing to uh, to document your uh, you know your experiences you know in life uh, and you say wow I went to this country I went to that country you know my uh, my regret in life you know uh, you know my biggest regret in life uh, one of my biggest regrets in life is that I did not document my uh, my previous uh, trips when I was uh, in my youth you know even when I was uh, living hand to mouth you know uh, when I was a poor guy you know I, I, I did uh, I did some uh, trips you know and I was uh, a budget traveler but not anymore you know uh, you know I got older and uh, my financial situation changed uh, dramatically so I uh, I am almost uh, I don't need to work anymore you know work has become uh, optional now I can just uh, I can just live my life and work and uh, travel the world you know and uh, and live off my uh, investments uh, investments uh, returns and anyway uh, folks uh, have a have a wonderful day and uh, I really hope you enjoyed this uh, this walk and talk this is my style I, us I usually just go out and uh, and just do my walk and talk and just talk about you know, random stuff in life and everything uh, anyway have a have a wonderful day take uh, take good care bye bye